Hello guys, this is my review about this P125 uh, Yamaha keyboard. It's a beginner keyboard with 88 keys. And in this video, uh, we will cover how to connect to a uh, phone, uh, your P125, and we will test all the sound of this P125 and also how to connect to main stage and uh, tutorial on how to maximize your P125 in live situation. And uh, uh, before we start... Uh, okay guys, we're back. We will start by uh, playing the internal sound of this board. Uh, and after that, we will try to connect to the phone and the laptop, MacBook, and uh, anything else that we need to do and how to use this board. Okay, let's start.
Okay, this is are the things needed to connect to our phone. Uh, if you're using Apple device, you need a camera connection kit. And if you want to use Android, this is the uh, USB to Type C Android device. Uh, you will need it like this in your phone. Depend on your Android phone. And uh, how to connect? We will try to. Take a video. If you want to play live in Facebook and YouTube, you can just hook this one up and to the video to your iPhone and it will stream uh, audio directly from P125 going to your phone okay setting up uh, P125 to your main stage or any other app let's try main stage first go to preference okay okay output set to digital piano so the output of this macbook uh, output sound will go to the p125 speaker okay, let's turn off the internal sound of this board so it will play the uh, main stage sound press function the both metronome and rhythm and this part the c6 uh, uh, there's an off sound and it's off already okay let's... now we can hear clearly the sound of the main stage okay let's set up for uh, contact let's try alicia keys and this one here alicia keys and then make sure 
okay to use to click this one okay you can if you can see that one the i button it should be on port a or you can click omni and after that uh, you click this one here okay and then it should be on digital piano your output should be on the digital piano if you want to use the p125 speaker and if you want to use external speaker or other amplifier you can use built-in but if you want the p125 speaker you can just click digital piano and that's the latency uh, okay and close midi also midi uh, okay it's okay and close and let's try okay it's sounding already okay guys why i use this p125 board why i bought this one because uh it stream audio from my laptop this one directly to the speaker of this p125 you can play anything in your laptop and it will sound directly to your speaker and i choose this one over fp30 because it is lightweight and although the keys is not that good compared to uh your fp30 roland but the good thing of this board you can stream audio directly to your phone and to your macbook so uh that's the good thing of this board and it's very lightweight and easy to use guys if you like this video give a thumbs up subscribe to the channel comment below for questions and also for other things that you need to know uh, i will gladly help you and that's all for now